Hey Jaybirds, it's the Jaybin here and I'm so excited. So welcome to On the Couch with the Jaybin. And this episode is all about my favorite summer picks for this summer. And so, let's get started. So the first thing that I wanted to show you is elf makeup. These are just some of my favorite picks that I thought would be really nice to show you guys. I don't wear a lot of lipstick or like lip color, but I thought that this would be nice to try out, which is the Moisturizing Lipstick by e.l.f. And I love the packaging on this, and I like how the um, box is matte. So let's go open this up. This is what it looks like. It's really small and compact, and I thought it was just the way they packaged this thing was really cute. Um, the color is Ravishing Rose. Ooh, okay, so when you open up, it's this color here. I thought this color was really nice. And when I swatch it, cool, okay, so that's that. I've been trying to look for a um, mascara that would be really nice to use, so I'm going to try this out and maybe let you guys know about it, maybe do a review on it. I got the e.l.f. 3-in-1 mascara. It got a 4 out of 5 stars, so I thought it would be pretty good to use. And it's lengthened, defined, and volumized, so it does all those three in one. So I can't wait to use this. I'll let you guys know exactly what I think about it. Okay, That's what it looks like. I love the packaging. Once again, it's really nice. It reminds me of a vase or a vase. However you say it. I don't know. But yeah, that's what I got. As you know, my favorite Disney character of all time. And one of my first Disney animated movies that I've seen when I was four is The Little Mermaid. So Elf is now doing Disney princesses. They've added that to their collection. And their first character that they're doing is Ariel for the summer. And it's the perfect time because it is summer. Ta-da! There is one more of these and it's the Ariel Beauty Book, but um, I went to Walgreens and they didn't have it. So if you're gonna get this, you can get it at Walgreens that's nearby you. Make sure that they have all four. And they also have um, lashes too, but I didn't get that because I don't like wearing fake lashes. Um, because thankfully to my family, I naturally have long lashes, so all I need is mascara to volumize it a little bit more and add a little more darkness to my lashes. But other than that, no, I don't need fake lashes. But yeah, so this is what I have. I got three out of the five. Um, I wish I could get the beauty book, but they didn't have it there. And I know there's some websites that they sell this on, but I'll put the link right down below. This is the um, bronzer, and it's called Bronze Beauty. So let's go open it up. I really love the colors that they chose for this. It's very, like, summer the colors. I love the color teal, as you can tell. Even my background is teal. This is the bronzer, and it's a really nice compact. Um, and it's called Surf's Up. And it has Ariel's picture right in front, or drawing right in front of it, so that's really cute. And when you open it up, it's like a really nice light brown color, and a bronze color. And it has some like golden shimmery colors on it. So I guess like when you put it on your face, there's a little shimmer to the bronzing. Okay. And it also comes with this really cute kabuki brush, and I don't have a kabuki brush, so that's perfect. I know it's tiny and small, but it's really cute. Um, I might get a bigger one in the future, who knows. The next one is this one, and it's eyeshadow, and it comes with a waterproof liner. Um, I've used the brown waterproof liner. Um, I'm not sure how the black one will show, but I will definitely try that for you guys. Um, and this one is called Under the Sea Eyes. So let's go ahead and open this one up. Like again, um, the packaging is really cute. And there's like a starfish in this one. You can see that. And then in the first one I showed you, there's like a um, scallop there. That's how you call them, but um, a seashell right there. This one here is called High Tide. And it comes with a nice dark teal color and then a very shimmery, like, light brown color. I don't know if that's brown, maybe it's 
like skin color tones. And then we have the Coral Reef eyeshadow. And I love how they just have these drawings out in front of them. And that's what it looks like. So it seems like it has like this really nice shimmery, dark off purple color. And then they have like this nice darker bronze shimmery color. It comes with the liner. So I don't know how this is gonna look, but I will swatch it for you guys. So that is what it looks like, this nice black line. Actually, I really like it. Um, and it doesn't rub off, so it's pretty cool. So the last one I'm gonna show you is this, and it's for the lips. <laughs> and this one is Go On and Kiss the Girl kit. So it comes with two glosses and then one lip stain. Um, I usually don't like pink like this, but we'll see how it looks. And we have the Sunrise color. Um, it's like a really nice pink color. I don't usually wear this kind of pink, but it probably won't show much on these lips. <laughs> and then we have the sunset color for nighttime. So for nighttime, I'll probably use this. For sunrise in the morning, I'll use this. It comes with the um, lip stain, which comes in the color pink petal. So nothing like C name um, color, but pink petal and it's a lip stain. So I'm gonna swatch this on for you guys too. It's like this pink color over here. So that's that, that's the Ariel collection from e.l.f. and I'm really excited to try these products for you guys and maybe I will do, you know, maybe I will um, do a little critique on them for you guys to see if I do like it and how it looks on me, but who knows. I don't really wanna do a lot of like these makeup kind of things. Um, I'll probably just do hauls like this, so yeah. As some of you know, and maybe not all of you, I love to play video games. Yes, I know. But it's a great, it has its good and bad sides, right? So my brother and I have a Nintendo Wii U system here at home, and we heard that Mario Kart 8 was coming out, and so what did we get? ta -da! Mario Kart 8, yes, we've already been playing it for a while um, since we got it, and it's really fun, it's a great, time for us to like, before he goes off to college, you know, have fun together with this game. Um, it brings a lot of memories of how we grew up with our cousins and it's just such a great party game with everybody. We can now play people online with this, so that's really fun. Um, great maps, by the way. Um, great new weapons. <laughs> I would say my favorite is the loudspeaker weapon because that kills the blue shell the dreaded blue shell when you're in first place um and i love the new cars and vehicles that are in this game and especially now that you can fly through the air you can um you know the gravity thing where you're you can go on the walls and stuff that's really cool too it's a it's a new addition to mario kart 8 um, Nintendo just keeps coming up with new ideas, and good job guys, I give you a thumbs up. If you get this game, you can actually get a free game by using their code, and I think it ends sometime in July, so guys, get this. People are starting to boot up their Wii U system, and people are starting to buy Wii U's here in the States, and so now Nintendo is actually boosting up, and it's a great thing for Nintendo. So, because of this game, Nintendo is kicking butt right now. Um, and the graphics on this is amazing, especially with the new system. I mean, it's not as good as the PS4, I can say that. But, you know, what I love about Nintendo is they focus more on the actual play when you're playing their video games. Or they focus more on story and how it can be more compelling to actually play. Um, and we got the uh, Zelda Wind Waker. <laughs> which is really fun right now, we're playing it right now. Um, we actually did get it for the GameCube system, but we didn't finish it, and so this is a great time to finish it, but we have to start all over from the beginning. But 
with the new technology that is coming out with Nintendo is pretty rad and I'm really excited for Nintendo so and for the future games that are coming out I mean they are definitely catching up when it comes to graphics but I love the fact that they focus beyond that they focus on more how families can still play video games together how siblings can still interact with each other um, and not only do they focus on that but they also are now trying to gear towards mature games in a way so that when you're older you can still play too and so it's the Wii U system is for the family it's for everybody and that's what I love about Nintendo um, and that's what Nintendo brings it brings good family fun um, and you can also have some you know big grown-up games too and um, I think what Nintendo is trying to do now which is pretty cool is have that balance between like kid games family games and mature games and so that's pretty neat for nintendo all right jaybirds well that's all i have for you guys for today i hope you really like this video and if you want to see more of these kind of videos please give it a thumbs up and i'd be happy to do them for you guys also you can follow me on facebook instagram twitter pinterest and vine and if that is a lot to remember all of that is right down in the description below and please leave some suggestions of ideas of any of the three shows that i have here on my channel right down in the comment section right down below so guys, as I always say, Jaybirds, it's time to fly away. It's time to fly away. I'll see you guys next time. God bless and bye. It smells really good. Okay. <laughs>